people in any profession have their own identity. We see several doctors wearing white coats in the hospital. There may be nothing more symbolic in the field of medicine than the white doctor lab coat. But have you ever stopped to ask yourself the question, why do doctors wear white? It may surprise you to learn that historically and up through the late 19th century, doctors actually didn't wear white at all, in fact wore black. As the medical profession advanced and things like germs were discovered, the American Medical Association describes how there was a push to remake how doctors appeared to the public. And so it became out with the black look of death and in with the clean sterile look. Sure, the black coat may have been a little more practical in terms of hiding stains or ushering a patient to the other side, but the white coat became a symbol of the new face of medicine. The white coat became synonymous with the portraying the doctor as a clean, safe source of authority in the new and improved medical field, and that image has never really left. Another reason is that before the middle of the 19th century, only the scientists who worked in the laboratories used to wear lab coats, which were light pink or yellow in color. At that time, laboratory scientists had harmed the reputation of the physician by showing that the treatment made by the drugs were useless, and that's how the doctors were convicted. While at the time the scientists were praised by the public and by the rulers, and the doctors or physicians were not much trusted, so the medical profession turned to science. That's how doctors or physicians decided to become scientists. The doctors adopted the scientific laboratory coat as the standard of their clothes, and the doctors began to wear the coat as a recognizable symbol in 1889 AD. When lab coat was adopted by the medical profession, they liked the color of the coat. And that's how the iconic Dr. White coat was born. Researchers at the University of Michigan surveyed 4,000 patients at 10 U.S. academic medical centers and discovered that a physician's clothing affects how patients view their doctor and their overall satisfaction of their care. However, the importance of ATA is not only about the coat itself, but also what is worn beneath physicians who wore a white coat. Physicians who wore a white coat over business attire were seen by patients as more knowledgeable, trustworthy, caring and approachable. The viewpoint is even more common in older patients about the, above the age of 65. Physicians who wore medical scrubs beneath a white coat scored next highest in patient satisfaction and approval. Physicians that only wore business attire with no white coat ranked number three in the study. While that preference could be an indication of what is considered to be professional, some argue that white coats present an increased risk of hospital-acquired infection. A white coat is not necessarily ideal for all doctors and physicians. Psychiatrists and pediatricians, for example, report that they prefer business attire to make their patients feel more at ease. The century-old white coat syndrome shows that patient anxiety about a doctor can cause high blood pressure readings in as many as 30. Another study has shown that 82% of pediatricians and psychiatrists do not like wearing a white coat because it negatively influences communication with children and mentally di distressed patients. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and hit that notification bell and get notified whenever I post video. See you next time.